Clary jump into the wall. Team Claridge is going to have it all to do. Cooper Luck has turned himself around in uh, turn number one. Four into one doesn't fit. Very, very uh, keen, you could say. A bit more work there to do for Team Clary. I'm not sure how badly damaged it is, but there's some panel work hanging off the back. So Cooper Luck, Hannah Bergman, Dennis McCart. On his outside is Blake Adams in the 83. Then it's Cullivan in 78, Rolton 26. Then Sergeant 62, birthday girl Carly Smith in 60, Tom Bull in 81. Then Matilda Brew in car number 46. And then right at the back is car number four, which is Cooper Lack. I think I've got that right from memory to start the program. It was a very, very over-energetic start by the juniors. As I said, they have progressed heaps. Some of them are getting a lot faster, a lot keener, a lot more competitive. And just a little thing like that, not even the grown-ups go four wide into turn number one. Looks like obviously some sort of suspension or steering issue on the car there of uh, Tyler Claridge. They'll lower that boom down, pick him up and off he'll go. Plenty of work to do for Team Claridge tonight. Is there someone on the pit straight here who can tell me who's driving the car for? Is it Cooper Lack or Chris Lack? There's Chris on the door. Cooper? Beautiful thought it was, thank you. Righto, Lovell on the pole. Hannah Bergman on the outside, then we go back. Now these two on the next row have had great racing all year. That's Brodie McCartan in car number 82. Blake Adams in a new car, car number 83. He used to run car number 11. And believe it or not, car number 83 used to belong to Cooper Lack, just to make it more confusing. So they'll sort themselves all out again. The light's still on. We'll go around at least one more time. They'll be... Chief Stewart's already been on the horn telling them that it's not one and run or run and one in the first corner. Let's have a sensible start. Tell that to any racing car driver. Sergeant will be quick out of uh, position number four in the 62 car. Once again, another young person that's improved as the year's gone on. Tom Bull in car number 81. This is his fifth or sixth race meeting for the year. 
brand new to racing this year. Coming around for a start. Ready for a start, flag down. Let's see how we go this time. I've got to keep your eye on that car at Cooper Lack. There's something not right with it. The front suspension bouncing all over the place. We're going to go yellow again. Spins out. But that car of... Oh, we've got a car now. It's done a radiator. McCartan has done a radiator. That is water. He needs to go to the infield. There's something wrong with the suspension and that on the Cooper Lack car, plus his bonnet slid up halfway up the windscreen. I don't know whether it's got a broken shock or what, but it's bouncing around the turns. It's not driving around the turns. Bad luck there for McCartan. That's definitely steam. He's done a radiator, he's blown a radiator hose. Or Is it smoke? Oh, Chief Stewart reckons it's smoke. There's also some sort of front end issue with that Cooper Lack car. When he went round the turns, the front wheel, the inside front wheels bouncing off the ground. Liam Cullinan going through there in the 78 car. I do believe that car is for sale. Yes, it is. 50 bucks. <laughs> A little bit more than 50 bucks. So if you want to get your junior into junior racing, that is a dedicated 1200 junior car. Yep, it is. So that can not race in the National Junior Series as a 1200 sedan. So if you want to uh, get into your 1200 juniors, there's a car to do it in. All right, they're checking out the infield. Right, oh, they line them up again. Chief Stewart's on the horn again. That's two starts. We're not getting very far at the moment, so the juniors need to just take it easy, get the racing underway, get a couple of laps down. You are that little bit more lenient because they are juniors and they are learning. Number four has been, we've been told on the horn that number four is definitely out. Cooper Lack car is out. McCartan is out in the 82. Righto, they'll go to the green again this next time round. Let's we try and see if we can uh, get this one done and run. So Lovell on the pole, Bergman on the outside. Cullen and on out of three in the car that is for sale, 1200 junior car. On the outside, Sergeant, then Rolton. I'm struggling to pick up the number on that other one. Then we go back to uh, birthday girl, Carly Smith. A nice white number would be good on that car, Team Smith. Can't read that 60 from over here. Then we go back to Tom Bull. They drop the flag and Melinda Brewer at the back. Let's see how we go this time round. At least we're only two wide into the turns. So, Hannah Bergman's got the hammer down in the XF lock and got away to a big lead. Moving right up into second now. Then it's Sergeant. Then get the third position there. In car number 83, that's Blake Adams. Oh, Hannah got a bit untidy out of two. She's wobbling into three and four. Blake Adams in car number 83. She might have given herself a little bit of a scare there. 
Maybe there's an issue with the car rather than anything else. She got away to a great start. Yeah. Then coming out of two, got all untidy. As I said, uh, Tom Ball's first year of racing. And he's just getting to that speed now where he's uh, actually spinning out. And spinning out is not a failure. It's a fact that means that you're going pretty quick and you spun out. You're not quite got control of it yet, but you need to be going fast enough to spin out. So it's not a bad thing. It means you are getting keener and faster all the time. Doesn't look like there's any damage to the ball car. It's all nice and clean. He will go to the rear. Let's line him up and get it going. Just need Liam Cullinan to stop over the back. Okay. Righto, the lead car. Blake Adams will be in the lead from Sergeant, then Lovell. Then Rolton, then Carly Smith. Then I think you're fine. Well, I'm not really sure of the back markers. Tom Moore will go to the back. Righto, now we're... Tom Ball, he'll know he's got to go to the rear. The other car, 46, has got to go and catch up. Matilda. Matilda is uh, relatively new, so they're going to let him go. Tom needs just, there, he's made a right decision, just go. So let's try and get this one down for the juniors. Onto the front straight they come. So it's the 83 car, Blake Adams, Tom Sargent, then Lovell, then Rolton. Then we go back behind Rolton to Smith. Behind Smith there is Cullinan. Then Tom Ball in car number uh, one. So they come around to the side. Blake Adams doing it nicely out front. From Sergeant. They've had a lot of good racing there during the year. So Blake Adams had a... Uh, he, that used to be the Cooper Lack car. Blake Adams used to run in car number 11. So he runs the front straight now. So it's uh, Blake Adams from Sergeant. Then we come back there to uh, Lovell in 21, Rolton in 26, Smith in 60. Then Bull in car number 81. No way they come around. It's the leader. That's Blake Adams in car number 83. In second position, Big Tyler Hardy and Sergeant. They're coming up on the back marker there. <laughs> Which is uh, the 46 car of the Tilton Blue. On the front side, they come around. They go around the outside of uh, Liam Cullinan in the little 1200 junior car. So it's um, Blake Adams. Sergeant, third will go to Lovell in car number 21, then we go back to Rolf in car number 26, they roll through, then we go back to Rolf in car number 